Hey everyone, this is Mr. Dunkel. Today I want to show you how to do a voiceover track to just record audio only over something that you have going on in Wii Video. So what you see here, I have a Wii Video uh, timeline. And I've added some background graphics. We see an instance here where I have a background image as well as a transparent image of a minion. And that makes it look like the minion uh, is in that scene. So we can see through the transparency. And what we're doing for this assignment is each of these are showing different types of camera shots. And so I want you to record yourself describing what each camera shot is. And here's how we do it. We go down to the timeline track and you'll see a little red microphone and you click on it. And it's real important that you click this preview or while recording because that will let you see your video over here in the preview track. That way you can see what's going on when you talk about it. Now to record, you put your cursor on the microphone and click it. Oftentimes you're going to get this little Adobe Flash pop up and you want to say allow and remember and then close that out. And then oftentimes you'll get a second pop-up box up here. You need to say allow. And then sometimes you get this third pop-up box. Typically, once you go through this, you don't get it over and over again. Um, but this will potentially happen the first time. So I'm going to click OK. Now, I'm ready to record. So I'm going to click my microphone button. And you'll see it counts me down. And now we're recording. So what we have here in this video is blah, 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 blah. OK. And then I can click stop. And to hear it back, I can click my play button. And when I click play, you'll hear it play back. Now, in my case, I don't have my microphone set up as properly as I need to here, uh, but it'll play it back for you. If you don't like it, you can hit the delete trash can and it'll go away. But if you do like it, then you over here on the left, you click the little checkbox. And it'll take it a few seconds. And what it will do is it will add that audio track to your audio one line right here. Okay. So when I click play, it gets along. And now it's, it's playing what I'm saying. You can't hear it at this point because I have the volume turned down. But this is all that you're going to do is you're going to hit record and you're going to record all the way through and tell us what each of those shots are as you're recording. And it will add your audio track all the way down here on the bottom. And once you have that done, along with all of your shots, all you simply need to do is finish. You click the finish button and click on 480p and click finish video. Now, it is real important, just a quick reminder that it will, we video will auto save for you. However, there is, if you come to the menu, there is a save button and it's a good idea to just save your work as well. So every time you add a picture, or add audio, do that quickly before you go to finish and you should be in good shape. And that's all there is to adding audio or adding a voiceover track 